Well, our first story is street evangelist Todd White. He loves to see miracles in action on the strip. So when he hit the Las Vegas strip, it was a group of beatbox dancers who received miracles. Watch this. Today when we were on the street, um, I know that we came upon a group of, of kids, these dancers, and, and it was amazing. Like God just went around and started healing all of them. Does your back, does your back give you any trouble right now at all? I need you to sit right here and put your back against that beam right there. I'm not going to hurt you. I want you to look and see one of her legs is like an inch and a half short. Oh, really? Father, I thank you in Jesus' name. Left leg, I command you grow. Right now. I feel it. Oh, I felt it. So good, 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 good. Completely done. <laughs> so good. at all right now. It's completely crushed. So this is like the power of God rather than going to church on a Sunday alone. It's the power of the Holy Spirit. It's the power of God that comes and crushes sickness and disease. Because I really felt my leg move. God could like move and touch all these kids and, and see lives just transform, man, just by the power and love of God. I want you to say in Jesus' name. Okay, in Jesus' name. Chest, Chest. I command you. I command you. Be clear. Be clear. Right now. Right now. Should be getting warm in there right now. Fuck it out. You're gonna tell him it's not there anymore. You're breathing better. You're really breathing better right now. Yeah, because earlier it was like. Yeah, but right now, take a big breath. What? What's going on? It's better. It's better, man. Is it gone? I'm not sure yet. Come on. Father, we thank you in Jesus' name. Chest, we command you be clear right now. All phlegm, I command you let him go right now. I did feel some warm. I guarantee it. Right now, it's still warm. Lord, more in Jesus' name, God. Heat it up right now. Yeah. <laughs> What's going on, man? Is it warm in there? It's starting to feel better. Yeah, dude. It's completely clear. God's amazing, dude. If we're confident in who we are in Christ and who Christ is in us, we'll walk in dominion and in authority in any situation. Okay, so breathing, do you have any kind of asthma or anything in your family line? Or uh, No. Okay, so we just want you to breathe better. That'd be it. Father, Father, I thank you for Philip in Jesus' name, God. <laughs> Lungs, we command you be clear right now. Father, thank you in Jesus' name. Breathing, I command you be restored right now. Father, thank you for wholeness, God. Lungs, be clear. Take a big breath, man. Oh, my gosh. Whoa, I can breathe, like, through both my own now. Really? Yeah, it was just stuck through here. Wow, thanks. I'm a b-boy. I break and like, I do. Yeah. I mean, I, I have, like, shoulder pains, but then, like, they come and go. Yeah. Yeah. So your so. shoulders give you trouble. Shoulder. When you move your arm around, can you feel tightness in the shoulder at all? Yeah, it, it pops like. Does it? Yeah. All right. Well, well, thank you in Jesus' name. Shoulder, I command you be healed right now. Every bit of popping and cracking, I command you go right now. In Jesus' name, let him go. It should be getting warm in there. What are you feeling in there right now? Yeah, it's getting warm. Yeah. Lord, thanks for no more cracking, no more popping. In Jesus' name, no more. It's tingly in there. What's it feeling like? It feels numb. It really does. Because that thing gives you trouble, man. It's yeah. Not, it's like yeah. It, it, it stops some stuff that you have to do. Yeah. If you guys like are all healed, you could dance so much better. I know. Dude, and I just want to encourage you to be the best you that God made you to be, man. Don't try to be anybody else. Dude, I love those dreads. They're fat, man. I just want to pray one more time. Lord, I thank you in the name of Jesus, God, for everyone watching. God, I thank you that you give them the dominion, the authority, that Jesus received the righteous reward that he paid a price for. He didn't pay a price just to get us to heaven. He paid a price to get heaven into you. In Jesus' name, be the church. Wow.
be the church. He paid a price to get heaven into you. It's a great announcement. The time is fulfilled. The kingdom of God is at hand. Repent and believe the good news. Uh, that's the first message Jesus gave. All it means is change your thinking and believe the good news. That heaven is not some far off thing. It's not far off in time. It's not far off in space. It's right here. The kingdom of God is here. And then later on, he said, it's in your midst. It's within you. It's within you. And when that happens and you realize that, then you get to express the kingdom and you get to have power behind the prayer, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Now, think about heaven. Is there anybody depressed? Anybody in pain? Uh, any sickness? Any disease? Any unforgiveness? Is there love there? Is there acceptance there? Yeah. Yeah, there is. So that is God's will, and we get to pray God's will be done on earth and in people, and we get to do it today, not some far off time. Jesus said the time is fulfilled. Now's the time. Now's the day of salvation. Now's the day of recovery. Now's the day of healing. Now is the day to take back everything that was stolen from you and me and to realize God's great original dream. His original dream for you and me to dwell in a garden. That's his dream. He hasn't given up on his dream. So don't you give up on it and realize that you're the church. You're the body of Christ. As Jesus was in the world, so are you. And you get to do the same things that Jesus did. 